Hello everyone, it's Mangamix here with some more cryostasis. Hope you're all doing well. Before we're doing it. Fucking hell. Fucking game taking about 10 minutes to warm up as per fucking normal. Okay, so we get to heal our health up to full straight away, which doesn't bode well for the next few rooms. This is chapter 13, it's called Beasts. Let's see how things go, I guess. I'm not 100% sure what I'm going to be doing here, but I think I need to do it quickly, whatever it may be. Get in there, get in there, come on, come on. More fucking outside dodging and stuff. Apparently all of you were happy with the sound that was in the last part, so I've more or less stuck with the same settings, uh, just a few tweaks here and there. have a look around here. So things are certainly getting weirder and weirder. Those wasp people are not nice and uh, yeah the shit's really hitting the fans to a certain degree in here. Topping is up again. It's always nice to be topped up again. Especially when we're probably going to have to go outside aren't we and uh, oh fuck. Did you see that? There was a dog thing. There was definitely a dog thing there, guys. God. That was like a dog monster of some kind. I mean, I'm, to be fair, I'm, I'm not that bothered by dogs. I mean, there are plenty of those dogs inside the Hill 4 were pretty bad. But... It didn't attack me, though. It seemed to sort of just lead the way onwards. Maybe it's like a friendly husky. I'm not over-optimistic about that fact, but still. Yeah, come on, get in the warm. This isn't really warm, is it? Oh god, what's gonna happen in here? What's the lights on? This room looks pretty ominous to me. Lovely. Do you like a good old-fashioned ominous room? Oh god, what the hell's going on here? Cutscene, brilliant. Unfortunately, I have the water gun to end all water guns. And you died horribly, sir. I want those things, like, you're fucking... Are they, are they like jailers, are they meant to be? I'm, I'm not really sure, to be honest with you. The game's all a bit cryptic and weird. In a good way, but, uh... Let's, uh, delve into this guy's mind and see what we have to do here. Oh god, what's going on now? Am oh, I meant to be doing something? Blowing a crane. Oh, I better get inside there where I died and uh... Yeah, 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 fucking... Give me a break. I don't think that was good, was it? Something a bit weird happened there. I'm not really sure what happened. Uh... Ugh. The floor was like vanishing underneath me, which seemed a bit buggy as well. And stuff. Uh, the stern crane. This is the crane, so how do I get in the crane? Or do I not need to get in the crane? Do I just go in here? Look, the floor is vanishing in front of me. Look, it just did it again. Yeah, it's definitely doing it. Some weird graphical glitch thing. I have no idea what's going on. Uh, I guess we need to keep trying and eventually I'll figure out what the fuck I have to do. Maybe I should just be really fast. I'm still sprinting the whole way. Let's just try going really fast. See if that's the solution to the issue here. Yeah. No, that definitely isn't that. As soon as I get there, I die. I guess something bad happens. I can't really tell what happens because the cold cut scene seems to be bugged. Let's try this again. Right, that's a crane. That definitely is a crane. Oh, hang on. I'll go this way. There we go. That's better. That's why I was glitching out. I wasn't going to go in there yet. Uh, Ah. 
Did I save the world? I saved the world. So I wasn't even meant to go in there, no wonder it was glitching out to fuck. Okay. Meh. Okay, that, that's definitely completely out of ammo. It's got a bit. To be honest with you, depending on what we're fighting, the water gun is probably my best bet in a quite a lot of instances. Uh, no ice in here though, which is kind of annoying. Bound to be some dudes in here. Bound to be some dudes. Should probably save my game as well. A lot of you ask why I'm saving in different slots all the time and covering all the saves. It's because, as a let's player, you don't want your saves to corrupt, and this game does corrupt saves. Oh, fuck. How the fuck did you get there, dick for brains, huh? I'm gonna pee all over you. Yeah! It's a fucking scary network, well, to be fair. You're not actually that scary, but still. Oh, 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 oh. I want that. I want that. Give it to me. Let me have it. Okay, that's out of bullets now, so let's not use that. Uh, let's use a lovely chain gun. It's fully loaded. I'm going to save that for big things, though. Let's keep this out for now. I'm not quite sure which door. This one seems pretty fucked up. But I will have those articles. My lovely, wonderful water gun of doom. Oh, I haven't clicked this yet, either. Is that in case that one kicks our ass? I don't know. Because it very much didn't kick our ass there. It just got peed on. I quite like how it just it stuns them so easily as well. Shut up, creaky noises. I don't like you. I heard a thing. I definitely heard a thing. Okay, standing there apparently is a bad idea. So I guess we just keep going this way and see what happens. It's bound to be a dude back to burst out in here, yeah, I thought so. Let's wee all over him, come on. Wee 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 wee. There we go. God, it's weird, is this gun make them freeze quicker or something? Or I'm not entirely sure how is it like that trap in Saw 3? I've been watching the Saw films. Oh, 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 light, light, light. Oh, lovely, lovely warmth. It's so warm and refreshing. It's like, ah. Oh, you feel so warm and cosy knowing that you're through that section. I constantly have to check my headset to make sure I haven't muted myself because I often can like, bash the button. Gotta be some dudes in here. Loads of rounds over guns, that's pretty awesome. Let's have a look in here. So far, nowhere near as intense as the previous level. Oh, I could certainly... Learn oh god! I am in... S oh, wow. I'm like in the viewpoint of a pig. Looking up another animal's ass. Oh, it's cow. Wow, it's fun being a cow inside this thing, yeah. Oh. Not fun being the cow in front of me, though. Do I have to save this cow? Because that would be quite really funny. Nah, I have no control at all, guys. We're just going to get butchered horribly. Yeah. Oh, well. Life goes on. Am I meant to save its life? Can I, like, hold back? Don't go in. Don't go in! Don't look into the light, Mr. Cow! I can't, I can't control it, guys. It's just like walking in. Don't look into the light, Mr. Cow! <laughs> Wonderful. Wow, that was really nice. Family gaming. That's what we're talking about here. Family gaming. Oh, God, that guy's been crushed by a bit of cow. To be fair, it kind of serves you right, dickwad. You're right. That's for you, shall we? In we go.
Um. Uh. I guess I wasn't meant to kill the cow. I have no idea what to do. Uh. Oh, I free them instead. And then that one doesn't land on me, I guess. Is that the way it works? Yeah, freedom, guys! Freedom! Peter! And all that shit. Hooray. And they all lived happily ever after in a big cow city in the sky. There we go. <laughs> and now the cows are gone. And it's suddenly very warm in here. I'm not quite sure why the cows have gone or where I'm now meant to go, seeing as the story is sealed, but it is apparently for the greater good. This isn't nice. Come on, guys, come on. That was pretty intense. And I definitely want your chain gun ammo. And I definitely want to get a gun out. Uh, do I go back the way we came? Does that achieve something? or I, I really don't know. What did that achieve, guys, huh? Any ideas? Because I'm clear this. I guess we should just go back and see. I'm going to save my game before I uh, forget to. I'm trying to save a little bit less here, guys, so it's not quite as unbearable. Although I may need to go for a shit soon. Fucker. It's always one of those fuckers as well. I must admit, this level so far... Nowhere near as intense as the previous one. There we go, that was a rather creepy background sound effect there for a second though. Didn't like that. I guess now something might happen. With this, yeah. I'm not really sure what I'm going to be doing though. I guess I can open the other door maybe back here. Let's soon find out. Something horrible is going to happen. Why can't I open this? Because you were waiting there. And I'm going to peel over here. And now the door will open maybe? Night. <laughs> so there's probably another one of you in here. Lurking. I have no idea what's going on. Except we're going back and forth through the same rooms repeatedly. Oh god, what's going on? The other one just opened. Yeah, it's one of the fucking big things. Beep Thank you. I'm very glad you cooperated, sir. <coughs> Stop twitching. It's unbecoming. That was nice and easy, wasn't it? So far, this has been one of the easiest levels. Hopefully it will retain this pattern. Here it is. Let's go. Jump inside, see what's going on. Have a swig of Coke Zero. I like the drinks are available. 
Nice doggy. Nice doggy. Nice doggy. Brilliant. Nice doggy. Oh shit. Ah! <laughs> I don't like this at all. Oh god. Just don't go near the doggies. Just don't go near the doggies. It'll all be fine if we don't go near the doggies. I don't want your food. I really don't want your food, Mr. Doggy. Ah, 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 ah. Oh, dog distracted. Okay. Go, 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 go. Yeah. Through the fucking kitchen with the dogs. Yeah. There better not fucking be dogs in here. There better not be fucking dogs in here. There's the meat I knocked down. I had that. That's for fucking sure and certain. I'm also going to save my game. That's for fucking sure and certain as well. No. Oh, fine. Never that one. Okay. Uh. Fucking hell. This is not nice stuff at all. Oh, there's a picture over there, lovely. Don't know what that was, I just picked up. I went for some random gun. I wrote some more icicle piece for my icicle gun because I didn't realise how fucking awesome it was until this point. Because it is fucking awesome. It's time for a little bedtime story, guys. Hope you're going to enjoy this one. I have no idea what it says. Pick up the fucking night. You shall die. You shall die, they shrieked. The forest roared and echoed their cries, and the lightning tore the darkness to shreds. Danko gazed upon those for whose sake he had undertaken such great labor, and he saw that they were like wild beasts. Many people were pressing about him, but he could detect no signs of humanity in their faces, and he knew that he could expect no mercy from them. Then, resentment seethed in his breast, but it was quelled by compassion. He loved these people, and he feared that without him they would perish. Lovely. Well, I'm just going to go to the Lugai, so I'll be right back.